Hello friends, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. So as you understand, this is about Global Academy of Technology, GAT College in Bangalore. So this is what I'm going to cover with respect to the overall college review and the placement details. So this college was started in 2001 and it's one of the autonomous engineering college in Bangalore, right? And the college is uh, located in Raj Rajeshwari Nagar and it's around 10 acres of area. So it's a decent infrastructure college. So this is the main building which is quite beautiful and infrastructure is decent. And this college is an autonomous college as I mentioned earlier. So this is one of the option if you want to study in autonomous college and this is affiliated to VTU. Apart from being affiliated to VTU, it's approved by AICTE and it's recognized by government of Karnataka. So this college is actually owned by uh, DK Shiv Kumar who is the Deputy Chief Minister of Karnataka, right? So he is the person behind the college and this is one of the picture of their main building, right? Which is there and these are some of the pictures of the college overall infrastructure. This is one of the picture from their AIML department. And these are some of the events which they host like aeronautical, aerospace and mechanical design conference which was hosted in the 2024. And this is picture of their hostel facility. So hostels are available for both girls and boys on the campus itself. So I have made a bigger video of campus too. You can check there. But talking about the branches which are available, you can study here computer science engineering and information science engineering which is ISC branch and then you have also have electronics and communication engineering ECE and electrical and electronics engineering which is triple E branch then you have civil engineering department which you, and you have mechanical engineering department and in the specialization side you have artificial intelligence and data sciences which is AIDS branch apart from AIDS branch you can also study AIML branch which is artificial intelligence and machine learning and there is one more branch with a similar name which is CSC with AIML right so both options are there and then you have aeronautical engineering which I have shown earlier and you have a science and humanities and the MBA department also which I am not going to cover in this particular video. Now I will talk about the placement so not much details are available for placements. Uh, in the current year but uh, this is taken from the NIRF engineering uh, you know details right so which I am covering for all the colleges so it basically shows what is the data which the college has submitted to AICT for approval, for approval pur purpose right so that's three years data so in the batch of you know 2021 passing 682 students were eligible out of which 549 students got placed with the median salary of 4.65 lakhs which is decent in the next year in 2022 passing batch which was the best year in terms of placement out of 757 students who are graduating 616 students got placed median salary also slightly increased to 5.17 lakhs and the next year which is 2023 passing batch out of 643 eligible students 478 of them got placed so little bit deep in the placement in 2023 but the median salary is similar like 5.28 lakhs. So that is the overall details which is available as per the NIRF document. So the placement related much information is not available but this is for 2024 batch which is the currently ongoing batch placement. The companies which have come some of them like emphasis which is in IT zone and these are some of the students who have got into uh, emphasis. So by the registration number of the students, you can also know the branch. So emphasis from aerospace, aerospace department, which is AD. Then you have a student whose uh, number is CS, which means computer science department. And other in other students, you can check it is mentioned IS, which is information science engineering. So you also know the students uh, from which branch are got have got placed. So this is emphasis. So this is the continuous list for emphasis and again you can see one more student in information science. In fact all the three students are from information science engineering which got the all the placements of six students in emphasis. This is another company in 2024 batch which is called Solar Edge Technologies. Again you see these three students and by their 
I, you know, student IDs, you can understand these students are from electrical engineering department because that mentions EE in the center. Now, these are some more students placed in the same core company, solar energy company. And you can see all these three students are also from electrical engineering department. So these are some of the placements of 2024 ongoing batch, but not much details are available to make a full video. That's all I have to cover in this particular video. As I get more details, I will make another revised review. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe channel to get similar updates on all the colleges in Karnataka. Take care and bye.